for whatsoever a man soweth. So whatsoever a man soweth, he said, F y'all, F God, F y'all. Whatever a man soweth, that shall he also reap. That's what he gonna pay. He's gonna Fuck pay for what he say. What you reap, that's what you're gonna sow. You yeah. reap corruption, you're gonna sow corruption. Right. Reap. For he that soweth to his flesh, he that what? Soweth to his flesh. He that soweth to his flesh, of the flesh reap corruption. Of his flesh, he gonna reap corruption. He that soweth to his flesh, he that loves sin, gonna reap corruption. That's right. He doing nothing to help his neighborhood. He doing nothing to build his people up. He doing nothing to teach your people. He doing nothing to teach your kids. But he out here trying to say F us because he want to do what we doing. He don't want to stand here like we standing here. He want to be a real man. This brother ain't never learned how to be a real man yet. But we're going to teach you at the end of the day. Read. Again, from the top, 6 verse 7. Be not deceived. God is not mocked. Be not deceived. God is not mocked. For whatsoever a man soweth, if you run your mouth against him, that shall he also reap. That's what you're gonna get back. Bullshit. What you put out, that's Bullshit. what you get back with the heavenly father. Reap. For he that soweth to his flesh shall of the flesh reap corruption. For he that soweth to the spirit shall of the spirit reap life everlasting. He don't know about the spirit in the flesh. Give me uh, Romans 8. Romans 8 verse 6. Romans 8 verse 6. Romans 8 verse 6. Slave shit. The book of Romans, Slave chapter bullshit. 8 and verse 6. Bro. For to be carnally minded is death. <laughs> Yo, God said to be carnally minded is death. That's you know, right. Think really, you're going to die here. Bring it out. You're going to die here. Nobody going to remember you. Nobody going to remember you. Nobody going to remember you. Read that again. For to be carnally minded is death. To be carnally minded. To be carnally minded is what? Is death. Is death. Is death. Read. But to be spiritually minded is life. So we out here with the spiritual mind. We trying to get life to our people. This man giving death to his people. We out to teach people life. We out to give y'all life. He out here to pass on death. Because he know his time is up. He know his time is up. And nobody going to remember him. They going to say this idiot you used to walk around cursing anybody out. He died yesterday. That's all they going to know him as. One second. You got to ask. Read. But to be spiritually minded is life and peace. To be spiritually minded is life and peace. Do he seem like he had peace? Do he seem like he had peace? To be spiritually minded is life and it is peace. That's right. It is peace. He don't know nothing about peace. Bring it out. This brother don't know nothing about peace. Read. Because the carnal mind is enmity against God. That's why he ain't at peace, because he's fighting against God. He's not at peace because he's fighting against God. Read. For it is not subject to the law of God. See, his spirit is not subject to the law of God. Because he's carnally minded. He's not spiritually minded because he don't know how to peace. He don't know peace. He don't know how to walk in life. He don't know how to have life. The only thing he know about death, death, death. F y'all, F this, later for this, later for that. Let's show you his mind at. Read. Neither indeed can be. Read that again. Let me tell that word on that scripture. Because the cardinal mind is enmity against God. The, the cardinal mind is going against God. The cardinal mind is opposed against God. Opposed against the creator. Opposed against the heavenly father. Read. For it is not subject to the law of God. It is not subject to the law of God. The cardinal mind is not subject to the law of God. Uh, neither indeed can be. So then they that are in the flesh cannot please God. So they that is in the flesh cannot please God. This brother is like a big kid. He, yo, Ruben, don't go nowhere. You got to come up. He's like a big kid. You never grew up yet. You the little boy in the playground that's still there 35 years later. You the little boy in the playground 35 years later. You never grew up, brother. I'm gonna tell you what the scriptures say. We gonna talk what the scriptures say. What? This is the book of Luke, chapter seven, in verse 31. And the Lord said, whereunto then shall I liken the men of this generation? Where unto are we supposed to liken to men of this generation? Where unto are we supposed to liken the men of this generation? Who we got to look up to? Men like this? 
This the men, that's why Chicago is out of order, because niggas like you. That's, that's right, why Chicago right. can't get right. If you ain't part of the solution, you are part of the problem. That's right. That's what it is. If you ain't part of the solution, Berwin, you are part of the problem. Read. And to what are they like? They are like unto children. They are like unto what? Unto children. They are like unto what? Unto children. These grown men out here is like unto children these days. They like unto children these days. Go ahead. Sitting in the marketplace and calling one to another and saying, We have piped unto you and ye have not danced. Catch me, catch me, catch me, tag, catch me, catch me. He like a kid that want him to chase him around with his foolishness. We ain't got time for you. We ain't got time to build. We ain't got time to destroy. We got time to build our people up. We ain't got time to destroy our people with the foolishness you coming with. Hey, what question you got, brother? What question you got? Cause we trying to save this brother's soul, but he don't realize it. Fuck my soul, nigga. Who the fuck cares about my soul, nigga? I got mine. Don't Go worry ahead. about the what fuck I'm doing over here. Worry about yours. Uh, I heard him make a point. Yeah, no, what point? The Romans. The Romans. Now, what about the Romans? I want to ask you all. Why are we following today Roman Catholic faggots? I mean, are those Romans in the Bible different from the Roman Catholic faggots that we have today? What you mean Romans? Because some of the Israelites was Romans. No, no, like no, you, no, 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 Israelites in America right here consider themselves Americans, right? So when you say Roman, you too vague about the statement. You got Israelites living all over the world right now, in every country, every... Uh, yeah. are the Romans of the Bible? That the Bible was the ones that... Paul was a Roman! The one that Paul went to see. Paul was a Roman! Okay, I'm asking you, are those Romans different than today's faggot Romans from the Vatican? I'm about to say that. All right. Game 101. Well, not James. I'm asking you about Romans. All right. I'm a, I'm on all right. All right. I asked you. I asked you. You said the Romans, right? Yeah, I want to. You said, are they different from the Roman Catholics, right? Yeah, I'm asking you. The Israelites in the Bible, and they different from the Roman Catholic. They don't keep the Roman Catholic traditions. We don't keep the Roman Catholic traditions, brother. We can't. Who, Paul went to the Israelites. The Israelites. Paul went to the Israelites, brother. You ask a question, you answer my question. Why did the Romans have a book in the Bible? Paul, yes. Paul, what's up? Why you got Ephesians? Why you got Galatians? I'm asking you a question first. Why we got Ephesians? Why we got Galatians? Because, because the white man gave us the The black man wasn't living there. The Israelites wasn't living there. I'm asking you a question. Before I get to I'm asking you a question. Did the Israelites live in these places? Did the Israelites live in Ephesia? Read James 1 and 1. He got no he got no understanding about us being scattered through the four corners of the earth. Bro, hold up. Read this. You don't even know me, bro. I've been doing this. You don't know me. Okay. So you saying we talking to each other. We ain't got to know. Me and you talking. I'm just asking you about these. And I, I'm going to give you the answer. I'm going to give you the answer. I said we was living all over. Paul went to the Romans. Paul went to the Israelites living in Rome. That's Paul went to the Israelites living in Rome. We are in the book of Romans, chapter one, verse one. I'm out here going to the Israelites and living in America right now. The same thing. Paul went to the Roman, the Israelites that were living in Rome. Read, James, a servant of God and of the Lord Jesus Christ, to the twelve tribes which are scattered abroad. Get this man some understanding. To the twelve tribes, that's what. To the twelve tribes which are scattered abroad. We is everywhere, brother. We are everywhere. And I gave you, I gave you, I gave you an answer. I'm gonna go back to Rome for you again. Give me Roman 9 and 1. Give me Roman 9 and 1 for this brother. Do you think he's slick? Let me deal with it. You know, we, we try to work with our people and give them the understanding. But our people think they know everything. That's the problem right there. Read Roman 9 and 1 for him. The book of Romans, chapter 9, verse 1. We're going to see. Your brother, are you listening? Are you listening? Are you listening? He don't understand. You know why? Because he's not keeping God's laws. He said he's an Israelite, but he's not keeping God's laws. That's why you don't understand this. I'm in the book of Romans for you right now. Read. I say the truth in Christ. I lie not. My conscience also bearing me witness in the Holy Ghost. 
that I have great heaviness and continual sorrow in my heart. For I could wish that myself were a curse from Christ. Paul said he wish he could be a curse from Christ. Go ahead. For my brethren. For who? For my brethren. For his brethren. My kinsmen. For his kinsmen. According to the flesh. According to what? To the flesh. According to the flesh. Go ahead. Who are Israelites? Uh -uh. Uh -uh. Who are Japanese? Who are Israelites? Who are the white Roman faggots? Who are Israelites? To who pertaineth the adoption? Who else pertained the adoption of God? Nobody pertained the adoption of God. Only the Israelites. Only belong to the Israelites. Read. And the glory. And the what? And the glory. Only the glory pertained to the Israelites. Only the glory pertained to the Israelites. In Rome, in Ephesia, in Philippi, in Philippians, in Galatia. Bring it up. In all these different places. Only the, the glory belonged to the Israelites. That's right. Paul is not dealing with anybody else but the Israelites. That's Three. right. And the covenants. And the covenants. Who the covenants belong to? Who belong the covenants belong to? So die here. So you're going to die here. And nobody coming to save you. You will die here in America. That's Three. right. Read that again. And the covenant. What covenants? The old covenant and the new covenant. Bring the up. old agreement and the new agreement. That's right. You're going to die here, brother. That's what I'm going to tell you. And the giving of the law. And the giving of the law. You know what's foolish about our people? They ask a question. Then they turn around and try to run like they made a statement. Bring it up. They kind of, yo, Bring it our up. people are jokes out here. Gee, That's gee. what the most I said. All Israel is not of Israel. You're not keeping law one, and you want to try to run with a statement. That's Read that. Right. He said, pertaining the covenant and the giving of the law. And the giving of what laws? What law? What law? What law, brother? The fringes. The Sabbath day. The law. The law. Read. And the service of God. And the service of God. And the promises. And who else getting the promises? Nobody but the Israelites. You would die here, brother. Read. Whose are the fathers? And of whom, as concerning the flesh, Christ came. Who is over all, God bless forever. Amen. So Paul dealt with the Israelites in Rome. Paul dealt with the Israelites in Ephesia. Paul dealt with the Israelites in Galatia. That's right. The man trying to make a statement and run. Trying to make a vague blanket of statement and run. That's why I like to understand what people say before they try to run their mouth. 1 Corinthians 1 and 20. For my man right here, Emperor. 1 Corinthians 1 and 20. No he answer. said none of us got degrees. Phony he said man. none of us got Fuck degrees. You. I want where your degree? Show me your degree. You said none of us got degrees. Where your degree at? If you're going to make a statement, show it. Show us yours. What? Show us your degree. Why would I show somebody? All right, then. Why would I show you? Brother to brother, why would I show you? Read. The nigga, book of First Corinthians, These chapter one, verse twenty. No Where is the no wise? Where and is the scribe? Where is the wise of the kimmy men? No Where way. is the wise kimmy men at? Where are the scribes? Where are the scribes at? Where is the disputer of this world? Where is the disputer of this world? Bring it up. Where are the disputers of this world at? That's it. You coming? You coming with all these allegations, but you have no proof or nothing you saying. You can't yeah, prove you nothing you said. You can't produce nothing you said. Read. Have not God made foolish the wisdom of this world? Haven't God made foolish the wisdom of this world? Of Kemet, of Ra, of the deities, the dead gods? God made the foolishness of this world. The dead gods you believe in. Read. For after that, in the, in the wisdom of God, the world by wisdom knew not God. By wisdom of God, the world by wisdom, by their degrees, by their, their, their PhDs, by their uh, bachelors, they know not God. They know not God. Read. It pleased God by the foolishness of preaching. How it, it pleased God. How it did? By the foolishness of preaching. How he did it? By the foolishness of preaching. I don't see the name Ron Genesis 1. Genesis 1 said a greater light and a lesser night. 
He said a greater light than a lesser night. He ain't giving no name. You believe that foolishness. You the fool to believe that mess. You the fool to believe that mess. And Genesis 1 and 5, he ain't saying, oh, 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 that that's right. I'm making right. He ain't saying I'm making right. He said a greater light. A greater light and a lesser light. No, he didn't. Read. To save them that believe. He said to save them that believe. That's why this man can't get saved because he don't believe nothing. That's he don't right. care about nothing. He don't yeah. care about himself. He don't care about a community. He don't believe Rye is in that sun right now. You don't see no eyeball on that sun. Bring it he up. don't believe Rye in that sun. Bring it That's up. a man-made deity Jeez. in Egypt that you're not Egyptian. You're Egyptian with Chinese writing on your neck. Bring it up. Read it. But God has chosen the foolish things of the world. He said God has chosen the foolish things of the world to confound the wise. To confound the wise. My brother right here is supposed to be so wise, but God used the foolish things of this world to confound him and these other nations. And God has chosen the, and God has chosen the weak things of the world. God has chosen the weak things of the world to confound the things. I'm not minding nothing. I'm going to tell you, just say the Lord. I'm going to tell you what this Bible says. You don't believe in this Bible. I believe in this Bible. I'm going to tell you what this Bible says. The Bible says a greater light and a lesser light. Give me that in Genesis 1. Give me that in Genesis 1. Because Rod didn't create the sun. God created the sun. Rod had nothing to do with the sun. Read. The book of Genesis chapter 1 and verse... Verse 5, and God Fuck called the light Get day, ass, and the darkness he Get called ass, night, and the oh, evening and the morning. That's just like a Play big kid. Ass, he want a name call. Ass, he trying to name call like y'all don't hurt our feelings. No we been call, calling man. niggas. We been oh, called black. We been called colored. We been calling bastard. We been calling all type of names. That don't affect us, brother. Them name calling don't affect us. Read. Verse 5, and God called the light night, and the and God called the light day, and the darkness he called night, and the evening and the morning were the first day. And God said, let there be a firmament. I, you gonna let what? I ain't stepping shit, this public property. Oh ass niggas. Fuck out of here, I ain't disrespecting none of you niggas. Niggas talking about they got Chinese shit on my neck. I'll talk about the doctrine. You motherfuckers want to keep it on the doctrine, keep it on the doctrine. If you motherfuckers want to get busy, we can go ahead and get busy. Eight. It ain't shit. And God called the firmament heaven, and the evening and the morning were the second day. Verse 14, and God said, let there be lights in the firmament of heaven to divide the day from the night, and let them be for signs and for seasons, and for days and years, and let them be for lights in the firmament of the heaven to give light upon the earth. Verse 16, and God made two great lights. God made two great lights, the greater light to rule the day. The sun, the greater light to rule the day. The sun, the greater light to rule the day. And the lesser light to rule the night. And the lesser light to rule the night. The full moon was the lesser light to rule the night. So our people confused with their own uh, uh, um, doctrines and they think they're going to come over here and stop us from bringing out the word of the Lord. That's we right. are here to do our job and we're going to continue. To preach a word to people, and they will hear it or forbear it. We did our jobs. That's right. Now they will see the true man of God. We are not black men, we are Israelites. Saying that I'm a black man, I ain't saying that no more. It's our fault, man. 
Hey, this is Bishop Nathaniel of Israel United in Christ. Please subscribe to our YouTube channels. Stay up to date with our latest events, music, and classroom lessons. IUIC plans to continue visiting different countries where this gospel has not been preached before. IUIC needs your help in pushing this truth. So join us. Subscribe to our Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, and podcasts, and stay up to date with us. For more information, please visit www.israelunite.org.